Hello everyone. In previous video, I shared with you how to install the Google framework on the Huawei Harmony OS 4.2 system, and then install the current strongest artificial intelligence, Cloud AI, on Harmony OS 4.2. It is even stronger than ChatGPT, and I feel that it is indeed the case after using it. Of course, I used the free version and did not subscribe to the paid version, because the free version is enough for me. Compared with ChatGPT 4.0, Cloud AI Sonic 3.5 is indeed stronger than ChatGPT based on my experience using it. Today, I will continue to share with you the installation of Google's most powerful artificial intelligence, Gemini AI. According to my experience, the performance of Gemini AI is comparable to that of Claude AI, and its most powerful advantage is that it can generate images and draw pictures for you free of charge. If you ask it to prepare a travel guide for you, it will give you an illustrated travel guide with pictures of attractions and other illustrations, which is something that other AIs cannot do at present. Other AIs can usually only provide content in plain text. Okay, let's take a look at my mobile phone. Let's go. Okay, now welcome to my Huawei phone. I already updated the latest version of the Harmony OS 4.2. And after that, I installed the Google framework, I mean the Google GMS for my Huawei phone. Let's check it out, the settings and the system and update, software update. I already updated the latest version, your software is update, updated, check for updates. So 4.2.0.120. So this is the latest version of the Harmony OS here. You can see your software is updated date is to up to date okay then I installed all those uh, Google GMS and you can see Play Store I can use it uh, normally uh, I installed the Google framework and the YouTube you can see the YouTube videos here yeah it's uh, very cool right then uh, let's go to the Gmail yeah I already installed the Gmail to receive the email and the Google map it can work perfectly, the Google Map and the Chrome, so I can uh, synchronize my browser history and uh, bookmarks uh, within my, you know, I already uh, logged on to my, my uh, Google account here, so I can sync my uh, bookmarks. Okay, then the photos, Google Photo can still work um, normally, and uh, the drive, Google Drive, and the chat GPT. So I installed the chat GPT and uh, the Cloud AI. I think that now the Cloud AI is the strongest AI, I mean, compared with chat GPT. I mean, the free version. Cloud AI Sonnet 3.5, comparing with the chat GPT 4.0, the Cloud AI is stronger than the chat GPT. Yeah, that's true. And the co-pilot is also the Microsoft, Microsoft AI. Uh, it can draw pictures. I think this is uh, its, uh, its advantages. And this time I will introduce a Gemini. Yeah, the Google's most advanced, advanced and most strongest, uh, strongest AI. I mean, comparing with uh, the other AI, I think Gemini is also very uh, strong. You know, to, uh, very clever. So this time I will show you some idea how to install and uh, use a Gemini. So now I on my Huawei phone, I already installed ChatGPT, Cloud AI, Copilot, and a Gemini. So sometimes you need to use different AI to double check the answer which is correct or not correct because the AI sometimes they will make mistakes so we need to use a several AI to double check if it is correct or not okay so if you have not uh, updated the latest version of the Harmony OS you can update it to the latest version of the 4.2 after that you can refer to my previous video on how to install the Google GMS onto your Huawei phone I will put the uh, video link down below this video description for you to see how to step by step install the, install the Google GMS on your Huawei phone okay so let's check uh, for, let's have a look of the Gemini uh, it's very useful because it can draw some pictures I already drew the using the Gemini draw pictures of a puppy watching uh, TV. You can see, have a look. This is drawn by the uh, Gemini. You can see very high definition, resolution, very high. It is free of charge. You can use it to draw a picture with, with uh, Gemini. So yeah, it's very interesting. Let's have a look. I will show you how to use it. Draw a picture of a puppy. I will, I will write it to. Okay, I write the draw a puppy watching TV. So something like that. I will send it to the uh, send it to the Gemini. Let's have a look. It will using uh, create your image with uh, Imagine 3. So it's very quick. It normally like take you takes you uh, three uh, ten seconds or so. So then it will give you here. You can see the uh, puppy is watching TV. So and you can click 
this picture and then right here there's a download button here so you can download this picture click the download button and this picture will be downloading a full size onto your mobile phone it's very easy just be patient yeah you can see image downloaded and go back to my uh, gallery and you will find here yeah this is another puppy so you can give more um, description about your puppy like your white puppy or black puppy uh, watching TV in the sitting room in the bedroom something like that it will give you more give you the picture in like uh, in the more diff you know in details yes that's the uh, you can use your your descriptions in details okay this is one thing and another thing is you can uh, the Gemini can give you the uh, uh, travel guide here I will show you yeah the travel guide give me a five-day travel itinerary from Tokyo to Thailand with uh, detailed hour by hour schedule with some pictures so that's the strongest thing is that uh, Gemini can give you a travel guide with a picture with a sightseeing pictures of the sceneries yeah send it to okay let's have a look okay let's have a look that it will give you the uh, travel itinerary with some pictures but uh, you can now uh, I can, currently it cannot display it here in the uh, uh, Gemini but we can click it so that's the uh, difference compared with other AI so you can click this uh, picture to have a look open in the Chrome so it will give you some uh, colorful pictures of the uh, sight scenes here so it will give you some pictures uh, you can click to see it uh, pre previous time I see in the Gemini directly but now I'm, I'm not sure why it cannot show directly in the Gemini and you need to open the link to see that okay so let's see some pictures and uh, the itinerary of the travel uh, that's the advantage of this uh, Gemini and for the co-pilot let's have a look if co-pilot can give you some pictures I think it cannot with uh, with some pictures it only give you by plain text yeah by plain text the travel guide itinerary and have a look this Claude AI Let's have a try the Claude AI with some picture with the same words see if, uh, if there are any differences uh, for the Claude AI it will give you a detailed travel guide here you can see it will generate a document pop up a document window yeah give you the in, in details and we can close this document here you can see five day Tokyo to Kailan travel itinerary it will give you the document uh, by the uh, by the uh, cloud AI let's have a look the, the chat GPT I don't think chat GPT can give you the pictures only can give you a travel guide with the um, let's have a look okay you can see uh, the chat GPT give you a picture draw a picture to make the document colorful beautiful and uh, give you the artillery arrival Bangkok so day two day three and day four four one by one so only give you like a title of this uh, uh, travel itinerary so the uh, Gemini can give you more pictures about the uh, side scenes although now it cannot be displayed directly but I think this, uh, this will be a bug I mean, for the next version it will show these pictures directly and you can also send a picture here I mean for the Gemini give you picture send you a picture or you can take a picture and uh, you can give the uh, here send your picture attach and uh, ask the question like species species yeah species send it it will uh, identify the uh, this dog species and give you the answer let's have a look the dog in the image is a golden retriever yeah it will give you uh, the answer of this uh, picture so it can read the picture so uh, it's very useful uh, functions if you want to use this AI on Huawei's phone okay next step I will show you step by step how to install the Gemini AI onto your Google onto your Huawei phone let's just uh, delete this one I will uninstall this one and uninstall this Google uninstall this one okay then we go to the Play Store uh, to install from the Play Store Gemini so if you have not yet installed the uh, I mean the Google framework you can refer to my previous video I'll put a video link down below this video description okay so the Gemini is here and then I click install to install the Gemini into into my Huawei phone okay install the Gemini go back to my desktop and click the Gemini and go to Play Store we need to install the Google app go to the Play Store 
and install the Google app. It is very important. Otherwise, the Gemini does not work. It needs the Google app. Just be patient to finish this installation. Okay, finish the installation of the Google app. Then we go back to the Gemini again. And here, the Gemini would like to open Google. Always allow. Yeah, always allow and click OK. And uh, click Gemini again. Now it will open the Gemini on your phone. And go scroll down and switch. Click switch to the Gemini. And scroll down and uh, click use Gemini. Then, yeah, you you. Uh, you can automatically log in with your uh, a Google account because I already installed Google GMS, so it will use my default Google account. Uh, send you a notification, allow. Yeah, that's that's, a, that's good. And go back to Gemini. Yeah, it will just say hi to Gemini. Say hi. Yeah, hi Zach. How can I help you today? Yeah, it's cool. And you can let's have a try if you can, can, can play the sound. How can I help you today? Yeah, it can also can read the words and I give you give these uh, questions again and you can if you want to uh, re uh, I mean hear the answer you just uh, uh, play click play button okay you can see after the uh, answer finish then you can uh, click this uh, uh, play Five speak day Tokyo to Thailand itinerary day one Tokyo exploration morning 8 a.m. Start your day with a delicious breakfast at a traditional Japanese restaurant near your hotel. 9 a.m. Visit the So you can just listen to this uh, answer. Yeah, you can see. This time, uh, cool, right? This time it can display uh, the pictures directly from uh, the Gemini. Yeah, and after I deleted the Gemini and I reinstalled the Gemini, it's cool, right? So now this bug fixed in this version, latest version of the Gemini. So it is more colorful and give you the full guide of uh, uh, travel guide, give you the picture, make the uh, answer more colorful, more inform informative. Yeah, it's cool, right? Yeah, give you the pictures. Okay, so if you like my sharing, don't forget to thumb up and see you next time. Bye bye.